Okay, so here we have the original sketch on the watercolor paper in my sketchbook. And here we he have the completed sketch that is on the final watercolor paper that I'm going to use to do my final painting. And I am just going through and lifting with my gum eraser up some of the marks that are a little more dark. I don't really need these lines to be super dark. In fact, a lot of them I'll erase um, before I paint an area, but I'll leave the ones in that I need uh, as a reference until I have some things laid down. So that's the first uh, steps on how to set up your still life. Pick flowers that work for you, colors that work for you, and how to sketch and transfer the sketch onto your final watercolor paper. One thing I want to say just about your color choices is uh, make, keep, make it something fun that you're really interested in painting. Uh, you know, there's nothing worse than getting kind of bored in the middle of a project and not liking it. So, you know, think about that and keep yourself happy while you're doing it. And um, I'll see you guys on Sunday.